Hey guys, welcome back. This is MD, and I'm gonna show you how to get the night soil grass seed for the warm food. So you need these two to make the warm food to make the greenery around the world. Uh, so what we need is we need to like make a toilet, and for that we need one pot, uh, a towel, and of course like a create a small room with a door, and, and that's it. Then we need to like wait. So what I'm gonna do, you can choose either of these like uh, pots. It doesn't matter which one you choose, but as long as you have one pot and a towel in a, in a room then that's it the way I do it is like I just try to like make them small because they don't need that uh, big or enormous uh, space so just make it simple something small something that uh, and also make a lot of them because I, I mean I usually like may make around like three to four uh, toilets because I don't want that line you know like they are waiting for that line and at the same time you will get uh, hearts from these I mean whenever they use it you're gonna get one gratitude so the way I do it is like I'm just gonna like line four like tiles or like a wall uh, four by four so that should be enough it's more than enough so just like put a door it's, it's the perfect four by four is the perfect put a door uh, put a towel uh, put a, the the pot and just uh, wait for them to like go and do their business and you get the the night soil this is the way to get the night soil and, and as you can see we have the tiny toilet and on my right hand side you see that I already like made three of them and uh, as you can see look at my nice ones I got a bunch so I had like 64 right these are some more so I ended up like oh, 73 then here a bit more so 83 so I got like at least 10 10 10 from all these uh, like three I mean all these three you can like get the grass seeds from these monsters the hand monsters uh, these are the efficient way to get the grass seed and they you find them uh, here and the Sogus Cree Island and even the first island so these guys are everywhere and their grass uh, seed drop is very very high and you're gonna get them like almost all the time actually the the, the annoying part of this uh, thing is like the manual way uh, is for the night so, uh, soil the night uh, soil uh, by killing the monster is the hardest way it's not the hardest way it's like a long grind uh, you can do it uh, during the what's it called in the uh, in the Sogikari Island. Uh, you will find a bunch of like these zombie guys, the blue hair one, and they drop the night soil. Uh, I tried that. I mean, it's not the most efficient way, you know. Like you need to like find them, like kill them. These guys here, and it's not always a guaranteed drop. But the grass seed is is most likely there's a higher chance for you to be a grass seed. As you can see, I killed these monsters like nearly like nine out of ten. I get I get the the grass seed. So yeah, they, they are the, the perfect way uh, to get it. So yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna like show you like, uh, the, you can find these guys here like in front of your base, the second base in the on the Island of Waking, Awakening. Uh, the, the red tablet, you'll find these guys here. Uh, a bunch of hands and a bunch of zombies, you'll find the hands most frequently. But if you want to like uh, grind some more, you can go uh, to the Sogikari Island and you will find them uh, there a lot you will find the hands and the zombies but but the toilet the toilet way is is the really to be honest like the toilet way is the most most efficient way to do it and if you have like a like i said like three or four toilets then yeah you don't have to worry about like going to any of these islands except for like if you want to like get the the grass seed as you can see here i have like i had 50 and i made a bunch of uh, warm uh, food and now i have like almost like 10 to 12 and here I'm collecting look I got like I have 40 right <laughs> check out so 80 I got 40 from this one and another almost 40 from the other one and another 40 so you can see like this is the perfect way to get it you know like this is the most efficient way to get these things and one thing more I'm gonna like before you like leave the video and like close the video I'm gonna show you how to use the warm food efficiently you know that normally we just like put it there and we cover the area right and it's only gonna cover that certain area where it's like highlighted right that's the only area that the worm is gonna cover mm -hmm. so the way to use it like efficiently you can make uh, these uh, these farms you know like these fields so buy a bunch of uh, uh, what's it called these uh, pillars or roads whatever you call them and make these uh, fields it's efficient it's more efficient for, for you to like use it uh, make a field actually because the thing is like when you make a field and it just like put one of these uh, warm food inside the worm is gonna cover the whole field with just like one warm food so instead of like wasting a bunch of them uh, to like cover like a, a f uh, what's it called a four times the size of, of, of like when it, when it, what it normally covers you can just make a field 
and it will cover the whole thing. I'm gonna show it to you how it's done. Like for example here, I'm gonna make this field. I already have the doors, so I made like this uh, like giant or like enormous uh, field here, right? Uh, there was a door, so I have this like large field, right? So if I'm gonna use like one of uh, of those uh, uh, was worm food, it's gonna cover the whole place, place, right? So here I made another one. As you can see. It will it will cover the whole area as you can see yeah it's covering the whole area so this is why I was like oh uh, it's gonna cover the whole area so this is why I just broke the these uh, boards here and and yeah so now if I just put one of the these uh, what's it called these uh, warm food the worm is just like gonna completely cover this whole area so this is the efficient way and instead of like losing I don't know like 10 warm food in one area so as you can see here uh, I just put it there and the worm is gonna come and he's gonna like cover uh, the whole whole uh, area going around as you can see from the top to the bottom so yeah make these fields you know the when the place is green break them off cover another area make it green uh, you know gardening and and then break it off so yeah and the thing is like he's only gonna cover the places where we didn't put the rod so as you can see the, the under these rods is still uh, like we have the sandy soil and there's another trick for these uh, sandy soils but yeah this is the the efficient the most efficient way and I've done it here and, and yeah you're gonna have these like small trees and flowers which I always uh, take them off because I don't want uh, like a, a palm tree growing inside the the field and also you need to do them during the day you cannot do it do it during the the night right and yeah it's covered so now I'm gonna show you how to do uh, cover the other area so what are we gonna do is break off uh, these uh, these uh, areas and or the fields and we're gonna make another field which has which the what's called the sandy blocks or the sandy tiles are inside as you can see I made another field uh, covering these areas I'm just gonna put one warm food inside and yeah of course the worm is gonna like cover them and when it's covered I'm gonna break them off I'm gonna make, create my farms the way they were before and yeah, guys, that's it. Simple as that. I hope I help. And if you like this video, then please hit that uh, thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and stay awesome, guys.